fairly uh, change for you, obviously, uh, for Melbourne. A couple of, uh, well, one different event anyway. Yeah, definitely. Well, I'm down to run the 100 and 200 and I may not run the 100 um, simply because I want to put everything I can into the 200 to try and qualify. Last Saturday when I ran in Sydney in the 200, I felt that I could have gone under 23 seconds for the first time legally, um, but I kind of panicked, I think, because I was so far ahead and then I've only done like five sprint sessions this year. So it was really exciting and it's good to know about this Thursday that Something could possibly great happen. Something great could possibly happen. So, what do you take out of uh, last week in Sydney to make sure the same thing doesn't happen? Uh, just focus on myself and not worry about where everyone else is in the race, um, and just really enjoy myself and you know run as fast as I possibly can to prove myself that I am worthy of running there. When you talk about something special happening, what have you got in your mind? What sort of time? Well, I'm not sure how the conditions are going to be in Melbourne. They're known to have huge headwinds, so I guess if the conditions aren't you no know, perfect. I may not do anything special, but um, I think if the conditions are right and it's hot and the winds are going in the right direction, then I think I could probably pull out something under 23 seconds. Um, but I don't think I'm strong enough just yet with this with the strength you have to have for, for sprints to push myself through a, a, a strong headwind at the moment. So we'll see what happens. How's the mentality for you, the change obviously to, to the flat? Yeah, it's, it's quite nice at, at not hurdling at the moment. Um, I guess my hips are loving me at the moment, not having to push them through where they're not supposed to be going. Um, but yeah, sprinting's really nice at the moment. Um, nice change, I guess, and a rest from hurdling. And hopefully I can start hurdling again in a couple of months so, so I can get ready for Europe and then Commonwealth Games. Is there a sense of relief? Competing Saturday, yeah, finally, yeah, back, that yeah. sort of feeling about it all. I think competing on Saturday really got rid of the huge nerves that I had. I mean, I think running in Sydney was the most nervous I've ever been competing in Australia uh, because I haven't been beaten in about five years. So I, I didn't know what to expect when I when I came down to Sydney, but um, everything went my way. I went there to win, and that's what I did, and I'm doing the same this Thursday night.